Hi, I'm Chaz Kangas from Go95.3. You may be familiar with my show First Impressions, Sunday nights from 10 to midnight, where I play the best in hip-hop's indie ground and underground. What you may not know, however, is that I was in the middle of some KFC Twitter controversy a few months ago. You may be familiar with the news story, it was all over the media last November, regarding at Edget22, a Twitter account user who was allegedly the first to notice that the at KFC account was following the five Spice Girls and six people named Herb, which which is 11 herbs and spices. Edget22 is a good dude, not taking anything away from him, but if you were to go back a little bit further within the Twitter machine, you would have found that the very first person to find that KFC was only following 11 herbs and spices was me, at Chaz Raps. So, you know, these things happen, these are more popular. I'd never had anything begrudging to say about at Edget22. I think very cool that KFC awarded his finding and his tweet going viral with an oil painting of Colonel Sanders and him. And on top of that, they gave him like $100 in gift certificates and he donated all of it to a local food shelf. Very, very cool. But then long story short, word starts spreading that uh, someone had found that tweet before he did and they were asking, you know, when is KFC gonna make things right and send things to her, even though she didn't at KFC. And then as the ball got sort of rolling for her and started getting coverage overseas, someone eventually found out that my tweet was actually first. So then it wound up being this thing in Europe, hashtag justice for Chaz, when I'm talking to USA Today, The Guardian wound up covering it. Long story short, the Colonel contacted me himself last November and said, Chaz, we're gonna make things right. We're gonna send you a package of things. And it's been a few months because you know they have to get these things right together. They've got a lot going on between their original recipe and their extra tasty crispy recipe. But if you follow me on social media, you know last weekend a package arrived. And I'm about to show you the gifts I got from that. But what I wasn't expecting is a package that arrived on Monday, which I haven't opened yet because I'm saving that moment of chicken divinity for us. So here's what I received last Friday. Colonel Koozies, Colonel Pop Socket, or as it's known on the East Coast, a Colonel Soda Socket, Colonel Tail Stickers, KFC Valentines, a KFC Stress Squeeze Stick, and then because KFC sponsored the most recent WWE Royal Rumble, they sent me this WWE Royal Rumble hat, as well as the deluxe edition of WWE 2K18, where Colonel Sanders is a playable character. Sent me KFC sunscreen so I can protect myself via SPF 30 screen while smelling like original recipe. Two comic books of uh, Colonel Sanders, one of him and the Green Lantern, together at last. Uh, to show how far back KFC was looking in my profile, before any of this went down, I asked him like over a year ago, maybe even two, if they knew how I could get a copy of Colonel Sanders' autobiography. And lo and behold, I guess they found a copy and they sent one to me. It also contains the recipes in the back for how to make uh, all the delicious KFC offerings. Now here's where it's gonna get really intense. So, as I mentioned, KFC sponsored the most recent WWE Royal Rumble. And so they sent me this autographed Colonel Flair, being that Ric Flair is the new Colonel Sanders and winner of the Colonel Rumble. Uh, shirt, you know, it says Ric Flair 16 time, because he's 16 time world champ and woo. And then, as I mentioned, Edge at 22 received an oil painting. And I received this photo of me meeting the Colonel Sanders classic very important moment in any young man's life. The thing is, I'm not quite sure when this picture was taken because the Colonel and I, to the best of my recollection, um, never shared the planet at the same time. Additionally, uh, this photo of me, which may or may not be Photoshopped, you can't quite tell. Um, if it were, I have no idea where this photo of me comes from and where it exists, but this is my new favorite photo of me. And now, like I said, if this weren't enough, they sent me this additional package, which now, we're gonna go into together. To Chaz Kangas from Colonel Harlan Sanders. It smells just like chicken. It smells so much like KFC, that's so great. It's more KFC Valentine's and their scratch and sniff, which is amazing. And it says, ooh, a letter from the desk of Colonel Harlan Sanders. It reads, Dear Chaz, 
It is my pleasure to share with you, admirer of Kentucky Fried Chicken and champion of the Colonel, this bountiful package of Kentucky Fried Goods and Wares. Please accept my humble apology for delivering these to you so much later than promised. I pride myself on making sure that we here at Kentucky Fried Chicken conduct ourselves with the very honesty, integrity, and incorruptibility that comes with making the world's most delicious chicken. As such, I must humbly ask that you mention that you received the free product. If you felt inclined to speak about said product in some virtual, internet-based forum, as required by those federal guidelines we're hearing so much about, you can do so in plain language within your poster video, or you can employ your very own newfangled approach, whichever way you choose. Please know that it is with profound appreciation that I send you this swag. Have a wonderful day, and if you ever find yourself in Kentucky, be sure to pass by for a visit. I'll have the sweet tea ready. I think this counts. Let's see what else is in the bag. Oh, another Ric Flair shirt. This, this one's unsigned, so I can wear it proudly and show that I am uh, fully in support of my everyday life. I think I'll get the signed one framed then. And another Colonel Pop socket. KFC tuxedo shirt, just like the Colonel wears. I'm gonna become such a better dresser now around the office. And another uh, deluxe edition of WWE 2K18. Well, I gotta say, um, this has by far been the most successful tweet I've ever sent. I wanna send my thanks to the Colonel and everyone out there in Kentucky for all these uh, wonderful gifts. And uh, I'll be taking you up on that sweet tea offer. For Go 95.3, I'm Chaz Kangas. I love you.